All right, Killer Clan, welcome back to Giant Foods. Today, we're gonna make a huge waffle s'more. Now, what is a waffle s'more, you may ask? Simple, it's a s'more, but instead of graham crackers, we're gonna make waffles, and I got confetti waffles over there, and I have a three pound chocolate bar. Now, I've had this since 2018. I got it as a Christmas gift, and I never used it, and I thought, well, what better thing to do with it than make a gigantic s'more, so, three pounds of chocolate, a whole box of waffle mix, and two pounds of marshmallows. Let's put this thing together. All right, so you got the Pillsbury Funfetti. We're gonna go ahead and make some waffles out of this bad boy. Why Funfetti, you say? Because we're looking through Walmart. Mr. Pool's like, it's decorative. So that's what we're doing. So, by the looks of things, Mr. Pool, you need six cups of said mix. I'm pretty sure it's going to be the whole bag. Just, put, just putting that out there. These aren't quite level. They need to be level, but they're not level. You got three. It's definitely a whole bag. How much you want to bet there's six in each? About six in each bag. Probably pretty close. Hey, guess what? It's six. Get our egg roll going here. Eggs in. All right, Mr. Pool, so we got our water in. Then we got our uh, oil. We don't have light oil, we got the, the full flavor stuff because um, we're not trying to keep the calories down because there really is no way to keep the calories down. Three quarters of a cup of that for three servings. It says stir it up and get rid of the lumps, but what if you like lumps? Cool. You should just drink this. Drink it with the raw eggs, you'd be like Rocky Maivia. actually the wrestler. No Sylvester Stallone. R Rocky Balboa. Rocky Balboa. <laughs> Did Rocky my idea? Uh, I was just seeing how many people caught that. How many people caught that below? I was talking about The Rock as in Dwayne Johnson, not as in Sylvester Stallone as in Balboa. We shall see. All right, Mr. Poole. So there's our batter. All right, Mr. Poole, we're on. Lube up the plates. Shout out to my buddy Joel for hooking us up with a waffle maker so I didn't have to buy one because I couldn't find a square waffle maker anywhere, believe it or not. Ooh, it's tough. Most people don't try to pour out of a gigantic bowl. I'm not most people, Mr. Pool. I'm a rebel. A rebel, huh? I'm a rebel, like Rebel Yell. We ended up getting bags of marshmallows because I couldn't get enough fluff. So we're gonna melt these down as if we were making Rice Krispie squares, except I'm just gonna pour it on the chocolate when we're ready. That chocolate, right there. Brew. Mm -hmm. It's very moist. Mm -hmm. Not quite.
butt turn. Marty, what are you doing? Overflow. A little bit more gentle this time. A little more gent more more gentle. Yeah, that's probably good. Yeah, more gentle. More gentler. More gentler. one of the things you either like or you don't. Not really. It's kind of a give or take. Some people like mallows. Some people not like mallows. It's sugar. What's not to like? Sugar. Look at that. It's like how many lumps would you like? One or eleven? <laughs> Start melting some of those in. Look at that concoction, ain't cool. Butter and marshmallows. Can you go wrong? You should add bacon to it. Because you can't go wrong when you add bacon. Put your waffles down. Here's this big mamma jamma. Three pound hers for us. Look at this. It is broken, but it's been in the house for, like I said. There she is. Look how big that thing is. It's freaking massive. We're gonna put it on the waffle. What do you got that's gonna make me absolutely massive? Just trying to get huge. Put that in there like that. Chocolate bar too big for the tray. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of marshmallow right there. That is a lot of mallow. Look at that, Mr. Pool. Pool. Yeah. All right, quickly inside you saw in the clips before, Mr. Pool and myself went ahead and put together the world's largest waffle s'more. Uh, this chocolate bar alone has 7,000 calories in it. 7,000 calories. Chocolate. Three pound Hershey bar. Now it's hard to see, but I got waffles, chocolate, mallow, and another layer of waffle. I'm going to try to pull a section out and show it to you. Epically huge. Oh, look at that. that. Thing is like oozing deliciousness. I'm not gonna let it cool down. We're gonna get into this thing. Right, so, like I said, this is the world's largest lot waffle s'more. I would say it's about six or seven pounds, three pounds of chocolate, an entire box of waffle mix, two pounds of marshmallows, and two and a half sticks of butter. It's well over 10,000 calories of deliciousness. Without further ado, the world's largest waffle s'more. Three, two, one. Waffle s'more. Oh! I'll give you another cross section of that bad boy. I had a medical exam this morning. My blood work came back normal. Good thing it wasn't before this. Hmm. Puppy stick. Look at that. Mm. Surprisingly, that chocolate for being two years expired is not that bad. That's a three pound chocolate bar we have here. Coffee. I 
if I was good for this thing. So much mallow. If you don't like marshmallow, this isn't the challenge for you. Luckily, I love mallows. Almost as much as candy corn. That's a bold statement. That little candy corn. Oh, I lost it. Couldn't keep it together. I have bigger ones. Just the fun fatty waffles. Delicious. Do you want a bigger? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Did you say yeah, sure? Did you say yeah, sure? I'm if you know what that's from. And to bust out a bigger scepter. I like to try to go normal, it didn't happen. <clears throat> Piece of foil. Mm -hmm. I got so much mallow. That looks like something about Mary. know what you're thinking. Delicious. It is. It's freaking messy, but it's delicious. Not gonna lie. This spoon alone is heavy. Ah, that's thick and dense. That's what she said. <laughs> no, there's a walk one there. Comment below if it's like pancakes or waffles. I like Belgian waffles, big thick ones. Alright, so we're about seven minutes in, we're about halfway through this thing. It's delicious. I'm not gonna lie, that's a lot of sugar. A lot of mallow. If you're not a mallow lover, it's not your thing. It's like stringy cheese, but with mallows. You want to be able to set your napkin down? This is not the challenge. This for you. is not the challenge for you if you try to use a napkin because <laughs> totally sticking to my hand. Ah! <laughs> the bigger challenge of this challenge is not actually eating it. It's not getting stuck to it. I got my shirt sticking. I got stringers on here. I got.
Yes, yeah. Woo. I better have a disclaimer on the front of this one. This is a messy one. I was gonna say, they're probably gonna tell me my vehicle's extended warranty is expired. Mine still has a factory warranty, too. <coughs> I told that to the guy on the phone the other day, and he still didn't get the gist. Chocolate is like concrete. All right, Anderson, you get a little bit. Not a whole lot, though. <laughs> <laughs> He's got mallow on his face. All right, back at the task at hand, the most sugar dense tray I've ever eaten. Woo! I've got this glue. That's a real one. I have to pass forward that part now. I'm sorry, you have one. Wow. That was sticky. Alright, Killer Clan, so a little over 13 minutes to finish up the world's largest waffle s'more challenge. Three pounds of chocolate. Two pounds of marshmallows, a whole box of waffle mix, a pound of butter, ugh, over 10,000 calories, and hmm, how many grams of sugar? Maybe I'll try to figure it out and put it up on the screen. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at the Killer Kennedy. And if you're not subbed to this channel, you should be because it's free. And right now, as crazy as it is in the world, what else are you going to get for free? So sub to the channel right here below. I'll be watching. Until next time. Eat s'mores and no wait on second thought don't eat s'mores don't try this it's crazy take it easy <laughs>